Thank you for joining us tonight at 6. I'm Liz Collin. It is the last weekend in the 2017 legislative session, and state educators made their voices heard at the state capitol. What do we want? Hundreds gathered in the rotunda to call on lawmakers to invest in public education. Kate Raditz was there, and I know teachers had a few messages today, Kate. They certainly did, Liz. This rally was planned for several weeks, but it comes just days after Governor Dayton vetoed an education bill that would have changed the teacher licensure process. That vote was met with large support from teacher unions. Rotunda at the Capitol echoed the demands of Education Minnesota and hundreds of local teachers. Because we work with all students, we must therefore pair our high expectations with high health so that they will have the tools that they need to succeed not only in school but in life. People rallied to show their support for investing in public education. The gathering comes two days after Governor Dayton vetoed a bill to overhaul the state's teacher licensure system. If you don't have the training to teach, it makes it really difficult for you to reach your students. And they're undermining that, that process that teachers should go through. Dayton said the bill needed additional funding and that the system needs to meet more rigorous standards. At the rally, people held up signs that read kids over tax breaks. How do I explain to my children that teachers or programs are being cut at their schools when they know there's money? The rally concluded with the delivery of hundreds of handwritten notes to the governor, asking him to hold strong on funding public schools and to not lower licensing standards for teachers. All of the teachers said while their fight to protect the system is a challenge, their job is worth it. I don't know that there is language to describe how hard it is to be a teacher, but if you care about it, it doesn't matter. You'll show up any, 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 all, anyway. The State Teachers Union Education Minnesota has said in the past they want Governor Dayton to hold firm on not changing the licensure system, even if it meant not finishing the session on time. The last day of session is Monday. All right, a lot of work still left to be done. Thank you, Kate.